Hi there, this is Ranjit from tech2bus.com and today we'll be doing the unboxing of this Kingston HyperX USB 3 thumb drive. This is not a, uh, just an ordinary USB th uh, 3 thumb drive. Uh, this is the HyperX series from Kingston and the HyperX series are supposed to be the fastest uh, drives and I would have to say this would be one of the fastest USB thumb drives that you can buy and I want to thank Kingston Technologies for sending this unit for review. So let's have a closer look at this HyperX USB 3 thumb drive. So here I have the Kingston HyperX USB 3 thumb drive and this is known as the Data Traveler HyperX 3 and we have the 64 GB model over here and you'll be surprised uh, to hear that uh, the 64 GB is the lowest capacity for this uh, model. We also get other two models that's the 128 GB and the massive 256 GB and this uses the USB 3 uh, to get higher uh, transfer rates and the striking difference from this USB 3 thumb drive and other three, uh, USB 3 thumb drive is the speeds that this drive can attain and it says over here that this uh, drive on USB 3 port can get a reach speed of 225 MB per second and writes of 135 MB per second. Needless to say this is uh, insanely fast because uh, the other USB 3 thumb drives that I've used max out at about 115 to 125 MB per second. And to just give you a comparison between this and a traditional hard drive that you might use, that's a 7200 RPM hard drive, uh, can get a transfer uh, speed of about 120 MB per second. So this uh, uh, HyperX uh, USB 3 thumb drive is will be faster than your traditional hard drive. And I have to say that this is almost as fast as a SATA 2 SSD drive. And it states here that uh, this drive comes with a five year warranty from Kingston. And let's look at the back of the drive. Uh, nothing special over here. It says it's 64 GB. Uh, it says high speed transfer, shock resistant. It's USB 3 compatible and even uh, it'll work with USB 2 ports if you have that. It's backward compatible and it works with Windows 7, Vista and XP. Do note Mac computers are not listed because Macs do not yet support the USB 3 interface. So let me just quickly cut the seal and take out this drive. And again, uh, as you notice, this drive uh, is not going to be the re uh, really cheap because it's a premium uh, grade uh, USB 3 thumb drive. And uh, if I'm not wrong, the pricing for this uh, 64 GB model in India is about 9,700. This is the MRP price, not the street price. And I have checked amazon.com, the US version. And there I saw the pricing for this drive to be around 120 US dollars. So definitely it's not a uh, budget uh, USB 3 thumb drive. It's a premium grade drive. Come out, come out. Okay, that's out. And we have the drive itself. Let me uh, first see if we get something else. Let me open this and let me take out this. There's some literature, I guess. Oh, we have a line yard. I think so we can attach it to this drive if you like. And what else do we get? We get the installation guide. It's basic info. It gives a link to Kingston website if you would like more info. So let us have a closer look at the drive itself. And right away, I can say that the build quality is really good. This part is made up of metal and this is thick rubberized uh, so it's really good and this is the USB uh, slot and this blue donut that it's uh, compatible with the USB 3 uh, port so and I, I have to say the drive speaks of quality it's made of uh, pretty good quality and if you like you can put this cover at the back and it says HyperX and here it says the capacity for us it's the 64 GB and it has the Kingston logo over here and if you go on the back it's again says Kingston and uh, so I'll be uh, testing this drive uh, needless to say the reach speeds that uh, Kingston has mentioned are pretty impressive for this drive I am suspecting that my USB 3 uh, port will be the limiting factor not this drive so that's it for now for this quick unboxing of this HyperX Data Traveler, thanks for watching this video and do remember to subscribe to my channel. That's it for now and hopefully I'm going to see you in my next video.